trying to help people with cancer is the most satisfying thing. Not being personally touched by it, I get touched by it every day. Metastatic breast cancer is where the breast cancer is spread from the breast to elsewhere in the body. Once a patient is told that their breast cancer is spread, I guess the first thing is they think, oh my God, I'm going to die. Cancer is a very scary word. In the beginning, I didn't know what to think. I just thought this is the end of my life. What is really common and very real is that these patients just think this cancer's got me. They've got to go through the grief, they've got to go through the loss of control to come to a stage where they learn to accept that this metastatic breast cancer is now part of me, it's a part of the rest of my life. We're there to keep them as disease free or disease stable for as long as possible. Won't be too much longer, just stay with the machine while it spins around. Trust in any relationship, you have to build over time and you know, it's the little things that probably I do that go a long way for them. Yeah, there is that trust. And I know that whatever is good for me, she, she's not just doing that because it's part of the plan. She's doing that because she cares for me. And being honest with them, you know, trust is based on honesty and I've got to, you've got to keep it real with these ladies because it's life we're talking about. It's not just medical, it is emotional as well. If I don't feel comfortable with someone that I'm dealing with in the hospital, I'm not going to receive the treatment that well. You can't put a, any other word on it. It's a blessing. She even knows about my family, you know, how, how everybody's going, all the kids. She always asks about my kids. You do get to know their husbands, you do get to know about their family life. These are the things that mean a lot to the patients. For them to be able to share intimate details of their personal life, not just their cancer life, it's a really big deal and something that I'm very honoured about, which I have to reflect and think, you know, how important I am to these ladies as well. Being a metastatic nurse and seeing how people's lives can change so quickly does sort of make you appreciate the smaller things in life. A diagnosis like this definitely changes priorities. Having a big house, having many cars, it's not as important as the time that I need to spend with my family now. Don't sweat the smaller stuff and make the most of what life is about. Enjoy being stuck in traffic occasionally because you can have that facility to enjoy it. Yes, this diagnosis is part of my life now. It is every day today, and I'm aware that pretty much it's going to be part of my life for the rest of my life. I'm there for them. Sometimes I don't think of it as a job. I just feel honoured to be part of these ladies' lives.